Hi everyone, my name is Mosh Hamedani and welcome to the third part of my course, Become a Full Stack.NET Developer. I'm a software engineer and author with 15 years of professional experience. The demand for full stack developers who are comfortable with both front end and back end development is increasing constantly. And in fact, some companies only hire full stack developers. This part is all about architecture and unit testing. Some of the major topics that we'll cover include dependency inversion principle, repository and unit of work patterns, clean architecture, and unit and integration tests. This part is packed with advanced concepts and techniques. And I believe if you watch all the videos and do the exercises, by the end of this part, you're going to go from an intermediate level developer to a senior developer. Before beginning the course, ideally you should have watched the first two parts because there I've covered a lot of concepts and techniques. So if you're new to this series, you may wonder why I have done things in a certain way or you may think I'm coding too fast. If that's the case, then you really need to go back and start from the first part. Also, you should have some basic familiarity with unit testing. At least you should have gone through one tutorial and be familiar with assertions and mocking. In this part, I will show you the proper way to write unit and integration tests for your ASP.NET MVC applications. I hope you'll join me on this journey to learn full stack development with Become a Full Stack.NET Developer course at Pluralsight.